What is up everybody? This is FNH here with a brand new video talk about City Impactor. So in this video I'm going to show you what, well first tell you what City Impactor is, how you can use it, and basically how to install it without any errors coming in the way. City Impactor is basically a, if you know what Cydia is, a Cydia type tool where you can install um, iOS apps IPAs directly from your computer to your iOS device. This can be apps that are tweaked apps such as like the YouTube Plus Plus, Pokemon Go Plus Plus, etc. etc. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to download it and install it and what to do. So whatever device you have, whatever whether it's Mac, Windows, Linux, I have Windows, so I you download it, extract it through WinRAR if you have it, and that's it. You don't even have to like install it, you just run the exe file. Once that's done, go to um, iOSNinja.io or wherever you want to get your IPA file from and do download IPA. I have it downloaded, so I'm not going to re-download it. Um, that's about it. We're going to do Pokemon Go and we're going to have that downloaded. Once you have it downloaded, open your folder that you uh, extracted and in here it'll say impactor.exe. Just run it normally. You don't have to run it through administrator or whatnot. And this is what you should see. You should see it saying iPhone and then you should see it saying install city extender. You don't need to install that. That's complete, something completely different and you can ignore it. Now a few steps that I do want to let you know is make sure you are logged into iTunes and signed in with your Apple ID. Your, I believe your actual Apple ID. And once you're in Cydia Impactor, it's going to tell you like you just have to drag and drop the IPA file in it. It's literally going to tell you to use your login with your Apple ID. Now, I am actually logging in with a different Apple ID, not my actual Apple ID. The reason for that is because my actual Apple ID has an underscore in it. For some odd reason, this app does not let you download, not the Pokemon Go app, Cydia Impactor. If you have for some odd reason an underscore it's not an odd reason if you have an underscore an exclamation mark a dot in your email it will not work it will fail you need to literally create a brand new apple id and use that login with that over here and then it will work so it doesn't really matter you can never use that apple id in your life you just need to use it log in and that's it i made one brand new from scratch for that purpose and yeah as you can see i literally use that that is not my apple id and after that once that's done it literally logs in. it it starts downloading it it'll take some time it takes like about like anywhere from like two to five minutes it can take some time and once you have it downloaded it'll work perfectly fine it'll say it was basically by that email that you put in it'll say it, it, this person has it it's authorized and it'll work there won't be any revokes happening you don't need a jailbroken iphone you don't need anything it's literally just a simple app that you download to your computer you drag and drop an ip file and then that's it it works and it downloads to your ios device so it's actually pretty easy pretty straightforward pretty simple to, uh instructions to follow and whatnot and it works pretty well uh i would highly recommend if you want to do this and you don't want to run into any issues about like uh having revoked access and whatnot the app works perfectly fine it'll work until you i don't know how you'll have to update it you may have to do it through the um this process again like re-download re-transfer or again if you prefer doing it from the ios ninja website itself you can just tap to install this is more for if there is no tap to install function and you want to drag and drop it in there that's obviously this is obviously for that as well so definitely give that a shot but yeah that's about it um last portion is usually like it installs it it verifies it which is this portion and once that's done the app is there and it's installed <laughs> so actually i would highly recommend giving this a shot if you definitely want to um try downloading other types of apps that are not over there there may be in tutu but you don't want to get those ads because this supposedly gets rid of ads as well supposedly but i've still seen them but i've heard it supposedly does i don't know why they said that but yeah i would highly recommend going down this route if you'd like but um yeah let me know your thoughts below guys if you have any comments questions concerns if any error come up definitely let me know in the comments below i will definitely walk you through it and help as much as i possibly can if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe and overall if you like the video give it a thumbs up it helps a lot other than that fnh out peace